Hi, welcome this week's Mercy One Minute and a Happy New Year to 2024 as we we start the new year off here. But uh, Kelly and I first wanted to address the incident that occurred last Friday uh, here at Waterloo Medical Center's main campus. Uh, Friday morning, um, there was an overhead announcement for an external threat, which then turned internal announcement for an internal threat. Um, obviously, since more information came available, we, we found out it was an accidental discharge of a firearm in a restroom near the lab draw station and check-in area on the second floor circle desk. Um, so since then, we continue to work with the Waterloo PD on the investigation and debrief from the incident. Uh, but but that Friday morning there for an hour, Kelly, is when, where most of the action happened. Yeah, and there were lots of people involved in that, um, trying to sort out what was going on and, and respond to it. So, you know, I always hate to call out different groups of people because I'm afraid I'll miss somebody. But security was instrumental, Waterloo Police, um, facilities, safety officer house supervisor and others, you know, were, were very much key into trying to sort out what was going on, what was happening and making sure announcements were going overhead. As you mentioned, Ryan, we'll, we'll do a debrief to try and identify how could we have managed that better. Um, so more, more work to take place on that. But um, just wanted to call out, you know, there are resources available for our colleagues because situations like this can be very distressing, upsetting. Um, so if you were in the building or even not in the building and it's very upsetting to you, don't don't be afraid to reach out to our EAP vendor Spring Health and, and kind of talk through that and, and work through those feelings. Yeah. And, and if you have any questions at all, please reach out to Kelly and myself directly. We'll be happy to talk to you or answer any questions or get you in the right direction as well. Um, and just once again, thank you to our colleagues in the Waterloo PD as we continue to work through that. Uh, we, we wish you a happy new year and a happy 2024 and we look forward to what this year will bring.